Good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon. Hope everybody had a great beginning of a Monday, a great beginning of the week. I made my video this morning, so I'm good. That's the goal. The goal is one, waking up, two, being thankful, three, making a video. Everything after that, in my opinion, is a bonus. So it is what it is. That's, that's the type of time I'm on right now. Anyway. Back to the second video of the day. So, I love buffalo sauce, right? I had some leftover buffalo sauce right here that I made. I don't remember when I made. Oh, I made it last week at work. And um, I let my boy Lipney try it. A buffalo chicken sandwich. The, uh, the buffalo chicken sandwich that um, I made in my Instagram stories that if you follow me. If you don't follow me, you should follow me. Um, the Spice Box, that's my IG handle. Anyway, do a lot of stories and stuff that I'm creating and things like that. Anyway, so, you know, buffalo wings and we're trying this health thing and we're also trying to incorporate new ideas and things like that. So I'm trying anything that I feel, you know, would work. So I've seen it before, but I've never tried it myself. So I'm going to try it today myself for the first time. So got some cauliflower, rinsed it off, pieced it up. I got my own buffalo sauce. I got some lemon pepper seasoning. Got a bowl. And I have a baking pan that I'm going to use to bake the cauliflower before we put it in the sauce. So get your pan. Spray it, some non-stick of your choice. Put the pieces in there. This is gonna be an easy video. This video should be um, fairly quick and simple. So, which, which every now and then you need to because I really wanna make the videos you know, user friendly as possible. I want people to try these things at home and I want people to get into cooking and stuff. So, a oil of your choice, lightly, very light. Lemon pepper. As generous as you would like. Fresh ground pepper, which I use in everything. And we're just gonna lightly, just gonna lightly toss it around. Nothing crazy, just lightly. So you may be looking at this like, why didn't I use the bowl? Because we're gonna toss it in the buffalo sauce, that's why. All right, nice little toss. And we are gonna bake this in the oven for 10, no, for 12 to 15 minutes at um, 425 degrees. So let's go into the oven. Remember, 425. Oven's nice and hot. And boom. All right, let's check it in 13 minutes. Okay, so 20 minutes later, because 425 and my oven doesn't really feel like 425, so got the cauliflower out. And want it to crisp up a little bit and want it to be like that, right? So here's what we're gonna do, because we're not done. We're gonna put it in the bowl. Right? And we're saving this because it has to go back in the oven because sauce is not, is not uh, warm. So, mm, they're almost there. Like, I think by the time the sauce heats up, um, this will be ready. So I'm gonna use all of this because I don't like leftovers and I'm surprised actually that I still had this. 
So, now if you want a sauce, I have, what do I have that I can show you? I have one of these. Same thing, you could use that, you don't have to, it's all good. Um, toss. Nice, nice, nice. And back into the baking pan. Nice, nice, nice. Very simple. Face the florets up because presentation is everything. And there we go. And we're gonna go back in the oven for, I'm gonna say 10 minutes. I'd say five, but every, every time I say a number, it's always not the right number, so. I'm gonna say 10 minutes. Still at 425. Next time though, I will go 450, to be honest with you. So, let's go. Back in the oven. Yeah. All right. We're gonna give it 10. All right. Um, so update on time. The 20 minutes was actually 30 minutes, and now the five minutes is actually 10 minutes. So altogether, this is a 40 minute oven time situation that we got going on. And again, this is the house oven and everyone's oven is different, but my 425 does not feel like 425. It actually feels like 375, but you know, that's just me and my experiences of cooking and things like that. So here we go. And this is what we got right now. And this is really, really nice. All right, so I can't pull this out with one hand. So let me bring you back here. And I will have to get a tongue. See, these are one take videos. I don't like, there's no rehearsing things here. So these things happen. Just want to show you how authentic things are. So, boom. Got the tongue right here. It's another one you guys haven't seen yet. I just got it the other day. It's my red silicone. Because you can't keep having black every day, right? All right, so check it out. Got a little platter right here because I figure why put it on a plate? You should put it on a platter because... Oh, let me close the oven. Because, um... This is kind of an appetizer, right? So this is something that you would take some toothpicks, poke it and, you know, pick at it, whatever, things like that. This could be a meal if you want to, but you know, if you're avoiding meat and things like that, but it doesn't have to be. So chives, I grated some fresh Parmigiano, uh, yeah, Parmesan, and need a spatula. So spatula and we're just gonna transfer right here the pieces so oh let me not stain my cutting board because I'll be really pissed off if that happens okay so just put the pieces and you know transfer you don't want the residual juice just want the pieces like so just like that this is nice. They feel soft. Everything is tender. So here's what you want to do, right? This, this is how I'm looking at it. You don't get no fresh than this. Look. Boom. So this is how I'm looking at it right now. I shredded the parm. So let us drizzle the parm on the top. Just like that. If you're a person that doesn't like parm, I don't know what's wrong with you. No, I'm just kidding. And, you know, parm is optional, of course. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding chives parsley if you want but parsley to me is boring i don't like parsley anymore i like chives or i like fresh basil or i like um scallions a lot more flavor so boom that's what that that right there is so incredible 
so incredible. Anyway, JV, Spice Box. Hope you enjoyed this video. Till next time. Well, till tomorrow, actually. That's next time. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment. I appreciate you all. Thank you. Later.